Welcome back to TV5 News at 9. Joining us this morning is NAACP President Terry Pruitt and Freedom Fund Chairperson Kanika Owens Robinson. Thank you both so much for being here. We're glad you're in the studio with us this morning. How are you? Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Great. Okay, so it is time to get inspired. Viewers, the NAACP Freedom Fund celebration is coming up, and it is going to be a celebration like no other. This year, it's not virtual. We're in person, right? So, President Pruitt, why is this year so different, and what can people expect from the event this year? This year uh, is a little bit different in yeah. that uh, we weren't able to do this last year because of uh, yeah, the right. events sur surrounding uh, the coronavirus. Yes. And so we're very pleased that we're able to reconvene the community, bring the community back together in celebration of uh, our NAACP, which has been in this community 102 years. Wow. So uh, this is our 50th uh, uh, observance of our Freedom Fund program. It's the only fundraiser we have during the year for the important work that the NAACP has to do. And President Pruitt, what can people expect from the event this year? Well, I want to let uh, the Freedom Fund chairperson oh. kind of cover some of that. Tell us. what well, uh, we are excited to hear what you have to say. What's going on this absolutely, year? Absolutely, uh, Colette. We yeah. are excited this year with the event being hybrid, meaning that we will have um, a limited amount of in-person okay. attendees as well as um, the virtual experience. And we call the virtual yeah. an experience because we're going to bring back and just try and make people at home feel like they're at the event and we're going to draw them in. We have red carpet interviews. Nice. We have the young man, um, Jay, as I call him, Jay okay. Morris, who is with Swag Magazine, interviewing guests as oh, they're coming we out love along him. with Joyce Harvin. <laughs> and then so we have entertainment. Yes. We have a, um, uh, we're going to honor some Saginaw heroes, Great. as well as some of the young professionals in the area. And we have entertainment, of course. So yes. I think we're going to have a good time. If you're at home or in able to be in person, you're going to be in it. I know. mean, it is jam-packed <laughs> with so much entertainment. I mean, you're not going to, you're going to be entertained. You're going to have a great time and Absolutely. be a part of the event. Absolutely. Tell me, how does this benefit the community? Okay, so this benefits the community. Number one, we want to raise awareness to some of the um, uh, community members yes. that have lifelong um, ser provided lifelong service to the community, and those um, four are um, doctors Mamie yeah. Thorne and Odell Thorne. Yes, and they Monica work so hard, Reyes, and yes. then bridge the gap. So mm -hmm. those those organizations do so much, they and do. those individuals do so much in the community, and we want to honor those guys. So again, showing those all, again, showing the young professionals yes. that are in the area, and just raising awareness. Um, and encouraging them to keep doing what they're doing in their careers and also being um, role models to citizens as well, younger, other young, <laughs> young people. Right, and let people know how you can just follow your dreams. Yeah. And Absolutely. watch these young people, Absolutely. what they're doing. Yeah. You know what I love every year is the theme mm -hmm. for the event. So you have to tell me the theme and what the meaning is behind your theme this year. The theme this year is always fighting forward. Oh. And that is, we piggyback the theme off of the national convention. So that was this theme, and it actually was a hashtag fighting forward. <laughs> Love it. And yes. so <laughs> what we want to do is make sure that we are continuously yeah. per pushing diversity, equity, inclusion. We want to make sure that there's um, fairness to everyone. We push um, fairness in education, voter um, educa right. voters' rights. Um, so many other things, but the, you know, we have what we call the game changers, and those are the things that this Freedom Fund event allows us to, um, you know, focus a lot of our work yeah. and efforts around. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, you, as I said, yeah. we've been in this community a long time. A long time. We are very pleased uh, with the connection that yes. we've had with N the, uh, TV5 here. Uh, we and love we're having pleased you. pleased to have <laughs> you be with us this year. So uh, this is going to be a grand occasion, and uh, I'm just so pleased that we're able to come back together. And I have to say this, Pruitt, uh, President Pruitt. Every year, I love to look at the audience and see it's like a rainbow it is. of Absolutely. colors. It is so the most many people diverse, from all around. Yeah. diverse event of its type in this community. Yeah. I mean, uh, the last time we hosted this event, we had well over 600 people yes. uh, from all From businesses, universities, of, all around. All genders, all yes. colors, and all And you're going to see that again. And okay. again, the... the Colette, yes. again, and you asked me what was exciting about yeah. it. Colette will be an MC. Yeah. Yay. <laughs> and then Very also another that. thing is, is yeah. that 
we, the hard thing was is limiting the amount of in-person. Okay. And so again, right. you're going to see that diverse crowd mm. and it is amazing. It is. Uh, it's it's going to be an amazing Okay, event. so how can people find out more information about this? So we do have a landing page, okay. but what I want people to do, the short, quick version of this is <laughs> <laughs> if you go to the uh, NAACP, Saginaw NAACP Facebook page, you will find a link to our landing page as well as in order to purchase tickets, you can go um, search us on Eventbrite, just Saginaw okay. NAACP, we should pop right. up and just click there and purchase the virtual tickets. Unfortunately, our in-person yes. pretty much sold out in three weeks. Wow, <laughs> that's great news though. We love to hear that. It was amazing. <laughs> yeah. But so now we're, we're encouraging people to go um, join us virtually. You won't just be disappointed. And we have giveaways. Oh, you can't beat a freebie as well. well. And as I a mean, last resort, yeah. uh, people can just call our office. Okay. Uh, we'll try to, to accommodate them. That's great. Uh, so just call the NAACP office here and we'll take care of them. Love you. Thank you both for being here today. We appreciate it. And I'd like to let you know I'm so honored and delighted to serve as MC for this year's event. It's going to be a celebration like no other. You will be inspired and have an awesome time as well. I'd love for you to join me if you would like to attend the Freedom Fund celebration is September 26th at 5 p.m. It's at the Horizons Conference Center. That is on State Street in Saginaw. You can find out more information in the hot link section of WNEM.com.